In the retail industry, data is power. We have a lot of clients with really robust data and analytics platforms, and having data is great, but knowing how to use that data is really what's key, because that's what turns data into great decisions. I'm joined here with Kenna Brannon, who's a vice president at CBRE and works with our predictive analytics group. Thank you, Kenna. Yeah, thanks for having me. So how are retailers using data today to make real estate decisions? I would say reflecting even five years ago, we were really slow to make decisions. And I think that the retailers didn't have to be as quick as they did. I think based on um, the influence of online, as well as some of the other kind of just service-based providers, you know, um, food delivery, things like that, brick and mortar has to be so much smarter about where they're going and so much more proactive about why they're making that decision. So there's every year kind of new data sets coming into play that help the retailers to learn more about the consumer so that they can react appropriately and kind of locate based on those consumer decisions. So with all of these new data sources, are there any that have really grown over the past couple of years that you see as having huge potential for the industry? I think the biggest one has been what we can learn from our cell phones. So in, in big data land, that's kind of referred to as massive mobile data, uh, we learn from both kind of vehicle uh, movement, so your GPS, nav, as well as your cell phones. So with this massive mobile data, we can see basically tracking your cell phone where did you come from? Was that work? Was that you know the shopping center down the street? Uh, how long did you spend there? Where did you go next? Where are you cross shopping? And it's not really the intent to understand you specifically, but general patterns of what type of behavior and movements are the consumers of that brand making so that as a retailer thinks about a location decision, they can be more informed about where their consumers are coming from and kind of what attitude they have when they're doing that. Great, so retailers and landlords are really leveraging data to understand both the consumer and the dynamics of specific locations. Absolutely, uh, and it's getting interesting too. Each year, there's kind of new data sets that are coming to be available that we can analyze and learn from. Um, social media data, for example, is a newer one where we can start to see sentiment about specific brands and markets. So as a brand is looking to, you know, it used to be kind of in the marketing side and now we're seeing for real estate as well, if we can understand kind of that brand perception and start to learn and see if we can model from that as well, it can help make those more informed real estate decisions. Thank you, Kenna. You've touched on some really interesting points in how the industry is leveraging data to work faster and better. So thank you for joining us. Thanks, I'm glad to be here.